over the last six weeks of devotionals. As we celebrated Christmas and prepared for the new year, we asked ourselves, are we ready for the King? Many different people prepared the way for Jesus, hinting at his grand identity with their reactions to his birth and the messages they shared about him. But Jesus himself best summarises the importance of his arrival. We read in Mark, Jesus went into Galilee proclaiming the good news of God. The time has come, he said. The kingdom of God has come near. Repent and believe the good news. The king has already arrived and now reigns in heaven, waiting to come again and make all things new. The kingdom of God is being built in the heart and soul of everyone who changes allegiances from the kingdom of the world. There is unbelievably good news in the birth of Jesus. By taking on a human body, God was able to take the punishment of our sin on himself so that we might meet the entry requirements of heaven. So the big question is, are we ready for the king? Are we a part of his kingdom? The preparations are quite simple. We don't have to be smart or tall or strong. We don't have to accomplish great feats. We just acknowledge our wrongdoing, ask God to forgive us, and trust in the death of his son who gives us saving grace. Jesus makes it clear that this is urgent. The time has come, and that is still true today. I am always taken aback by this quote. Without Christ, we are only a breath away from coming face to face with God and spending eternity without him. The King is here and he has the greatest news of salvation for me and for you. Repent and believe and rejoice.